Kiss. Kiss. 1065. Here he is. <laughs> hey. Darren, Darren McMullen. Darren. Oh. Welcome to Kiss, buddy. Welcome. How are you? That's a very hey. soft jacket you're wearing. I very soft it. jacket. We yeah. usually wear the velour tracksuit every time I'm here, so I'm trying to out-soften you. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Darren's got a new show. It's called Darren McMullen's Outsiders. Premieres on Nat Geo Channel on Tuesday, 8.30. I've seen the ad for this on Foxtel. It was, it was what is it? quite an experience. Basically, I travel around the world and live with very colourful subcultures of uh, humanity from ninjas in the south of England, Vikings in Sweden. Hang on. Uh, yeah. what, is there ninjas in the south There's, of England? <laughs> bizarrely, there is ninjas in a sleepy town called Weymouth in the south of England. And unbeknownst to each other, there was four ninjas ninjas operating in the area yeah. all ex-servicemen unfortunately really? who went maybe a little bit bonkers over in Iraq <laughs> and now uh, creep around the shadows at night in Weymouth protecting and serving but the lucky thing for them is nothing really happens like in the sleepy hero. town of Weymouth what Very experience strange. stood out for you what was one of the most memorable well you know what over the course of, of, of my travels I almost got my finger cut off by Vikings in Sweden I had my nose uh, I got a, a sword to the nose by Polish medieval fighters I almost had my back back broken by uh, the ninjas I yep. had two cracked ribs by entering a chess boxing competition uh, this and sounds quite a dangerous job it was quite this a dangerous like job I've voice. never been in hospital <laughs> so many times in my life and I was molested by 71 year old twin prostitutes in Amsterdam's red light district but I had the most fun I've ever had in my life. And now you're back for The Voice, which is yeah. a bit of a shake-up this year. Delta's gone and Kylie's in. She is, yeah. yeah. And, and Will I Am as well. Yeah, Will I uh, Am, I've yeah. heard Kylie on the show before. Will you mm. be pursuing Kylie as well? Or <laughs> the, or the plan there? Seems to be my MO, doesn't <laughs> it? Well, she said we had her on before. She's single as. I, she uh, yeah, is. I thought you were going to do the introductions right then. I oh, thought my you God, we maybe missed an opportunity. Plant the seed. Why well, didn't you I plant didn't, the seed, Kyle? I didn't realise. I didn't, I didn't, I, no one knows what you're doing because I, I see <laughs> photos of, oh, he's He's dating this one, he's dating yeah. that one. You never know what, what to believe. What is going on? Yeah, I know. Any, I, I, anything to report uh, there? Yeah, I'm seeing a girl in uh, in um, America. Is this yeah. this Teen Wolf star? She's a Teen Wolf star. Okay. You didn't yeah. go with the old ladies from... Um, <laughs> from <laughs> the 71-year-old. No, no, you didn't go there. <laughs> hey, you know what? In a different time, in a different place, if I could yeah. get a visa to stay in Amsterdam, maybe. <laughs> right. We really it's, hit it off. It sounds real romantic. Yeah, but after 350,000 men between them, I, I can kind of... Are you kidding? What? No, that's... That's, that's how many we, the men... Three hundred and fifty thousand. I, I really wonder what I could add to yeah, their party. Yeah, you just one you know? of many. They know. know all the tricks already. Yeah. They're still working to this day. Uh, I, I heard that one, what they stopped because of their their hips. But uh, <laughs> when I asked uh, during the show when they turned the last trick, she goes, "Oh, some guy today actually uh, in a taxi pulled over." I go, "Okay, why not? You know, <laughs> no way. You're never too old for it." She just does it there <laughs> she and then. Just does it there <laughs> and then. Everybody knows them in Amsterdam because they're yeah. all ex-customers. So it's like, "Oh, the taxi driver. Oh, he's yeah. got a problem with his." <laughs> <laughs> They've oh, got that's secrets. Johnny, Johnny. How's the rash, Johnny? You gave it to me. I don't like that. that that's too much information. <laughs> These women know too much about too many people. Yeah, they told me a few stories about you as well, but I won't say yeah, that. Yeah. Oh, now. yeah, right. <laughs> There's a lot of nudity, by the way, in the show, full Is there? disclosure. So if you've got Yourself? a weak stomach, yes. Yeah. If you do have a weak stomach, I suggest probably you don't watch it. At, at any okay. stage, do you have the, the whole wang out? Yes. Well, I lived in a I lived in a nudist village where the people live all year round. Were you pixelate that? They go to the, yeah. N well... In some of the ads I have been, but I think on the online stuff, no. Most fun I've ever had in my entire life, naked trampolining. It was <gasps> amazing. Great. So good. Liberating. Okay, we're going to tune in to it see that. It takes a certain sure. sort of man that can jump up on a trampoline uh, naked. Yeah. You, you're a uh, you're Well, it looks so much bigger when you're bouncing up and down. It stretches, <laughs> you know, so it's fine. You can check him out. Uh, Darren McMullen, outside his premiere's National Geographic Channel, National Geo People. Yeah. yeah tune in. Saturday, uh, sorry, Tuesday, 8.30 on Foxtel. Thanks, man. Kiss. Yes. 1065.